Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm I'm tracking down this huge bison that I saw. He's like, he's definitely has diamond, maybe diamond potential, definitely gold potential. But he's like, his lowest scoring, his, his lowest scoring is one um is 177 and his max is like 223. And I want to get close enough and hit him with the Rhino. Because that's the only gun I have right now that can take him. And not, because I want to get full score. So I want to get a long, a long shot with the Rhino. And that's pretty specific, but I just want to get full score for him. Because he's like, pretty big. He's a four. And I keep on hearing the crocodile noises. It's hinting at the new map. There's a there's a mule deer out there. I thought that was a fox for a minute. But let me yeah. So here's his here's his weight. I can't tell anything because I'm not like a super called the wild expert on that kind of stuff. But I know that he's big because of his scoring weight, and I always think that threes are big. This guy's a four. I saw another four. They were, like, kind of close to each other. The two fours were close to each other. Each other but, um, this one was definitely bigger. Because of his scoring weight. Why do I always say scoring weight? His just score. Yeah, so Mimina. 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 That's a new word. Minimum scoring was 177. And maximum. Oh, there he is. No, that's not him. That's not him. Oh my gosh. There's such a big bison out here. No, I'm starting to... I'm starting... That's not him. But that's also kind of big. He's a two. Absolutely not big at all. Yeah, the crocodile noises. Normally I... I, I'd be like super hype about them. If you go aggressive, then I'm gonna be mad at you. But you're not going aggressive. You're gonna flee. I think. Now he's just attentive. Now he's alert. But this one is attentive. It's for. You're scaring- you scare me. Yeah, so scary. You charge at me. I think I might just take this guy. He's alert. He's big too, but he's not as big as the other one. So. You can go ahead and flee. You're just gonna go attentive. This guy probably can hear me, can smell me. Because I think that they can smell really good. I'm not a bison expert. But he's traveling now, so that's not good. What about you? You're calm. You're calm. So if you could just, like, turn around and come back, please. That would be... Very good of you. You might be just leaving because of your zone just ended. So... If you leave, that's not good, but it's your decision, not mine. There's a two turkey. I do not know where that other bison went, though. He was way big. Like, probably diamond potential? I don't know, though. There's a two turkey out there. I don't know if that's big or not. But I'm not going to track it. Man, I'm just, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to, like, kill a bison out here. And they all, and I always fail to do so. Here's that. Here's the second big one. He's still pretty big. They're kind of similar. Except this guy, his max scoring... 
it's like 177 and the other guy's lowest scoring is 177. All right, Mr. Turkey, now it's your turn to gobble. Oh, turkeys normally, like, when you make crow noises, normally they go... Let's see if I can see him. Probably can't. But, man, I just want to kill something. I know that sounds bad, but it's actually quite true in the game. Yeah, that sounds better. But this pond definitely makes gator noises. Because, well, the game is hinting at the next map with gator noises. And, uh, and like, donkey noises. Donkeys. YouTube video? And they had people like, ooh, what's that? Ooh, that's a nice four. Prong. That's actually really nice. Can the 270 take it? The 270 can take it. So I may have to just shoot that from here, because... Okay, okay, chill, chill, chill. There's the old four. Well, there's not the old four, but... It's four. That looks like a boar head. But there just was a pronghorn out there here, out there. But yeah, there's definitely a pronghorn right there. And I may have to shoot at that. I don't know my pronghorn scoring. But I'm just gonna say that that's big because it's a four. And its horns look kind of big. So what distance is he at? And we got one out there screaming at me. Are you calm? Or like attentive or something? Yeah, see, you're calm. You're about 200 out. I'm a zero in for 150. I'm just gonna send it. That should have been a good shot. I was using the 270, so it's pretty good for it. He's dead. I got a vital, aka lung. He was a big pronghorn. I used the right gun for him. And, yeah. He might be gold potential. I think they go diamond at 5. I know that, um, the sheep do. Not the sheep. Yeah. I know the, um, f no, not the sheep. The goat. The feral goats. On New Zealand. I know that they go. I know they go diamond at 5. But they troll a ton, apparently. I, I haven't had one troll, I just haven't seen a five. I've seen like a ton of threes, and I think like one four. But yeah, so I'm gonna go pick this guy up. No tracking needed. I absolutely smacked him in the side. Maybe he's definitely gold potential, I believe. I just saw a bison out here. There's a four. Four pretty nice. They're definitely bigger than the threes. And I just got off of a track of a big one, so. Yeah, but we got a pronghorn, which is nice. Ooh. Ooh, vital organ hit. Bleed rate is high. Yeah, so. Yeah, so I got him good. A turkey. The Merriam, or however you pronounce that. Yeah, but we got a gold pronghorn. Did I do, do everything right? He was actually kind of close to diamond. Definitely. Pretty nice. And we got another pronghorn. Oh no, that's a mule deer. I thought, why did I say that that was pronghorn? I don't know. I'm gonna go ahead and shoot that guy. Even though I'm using the wrong gun. That was a spine shot if I've ever seen one. No, I'm just gonna go to a different map. I know. I'm gonna go to Yukon. Oh, I gotta sit back for a minute. Oh, my back's hurting. Oh, 
I'm tired. Do you guys ever, like, have a moment that you're, like, so excited for something? And then it goes by so slow to get to that exciting thing. With me, um, right now it's... What, what, what is it? I think it's like... No, it's Friday. Today's Friday. I get out of school on Thursdays, and I don't have school on Friday, which I'm lucky for. But, um... Yeah, but on Monday, I, I get to go skiing with my class. So, I'm, I'm definitely excited about that. Ooh. That's a nice caribou. What about that one? Oh, that's a moose. I'm gonna take this caribou. Looks like he's walking right at me. Oh. And, yeah. So, I don't know what I was about to say. I just said, oh, because I like saying things. But there's definitely a nice caribou out there. He's, he, he's like running. I don't know why he's doing that. Sir, if you would stop, I would be much grateful. Okay, he's alarmed. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna come on fast before he leaves. I just sent one and it hit. I just shot randomly into the bush. I didn't know if that, I don't know if that hit anything. I definitely hit this big caribou, which is nice. And I think I killed it. I, I just sent one at what I thought would be its lungs. But I don't know if I did get lungs, because it's not going down. Which, if you're trying to kill an animal, you want it to die. Sorry guys, I'm back. I just had to deal with something real quick. Alright. So, this caribou still isn't dead. Also, sorry for that loud bang in the background. I don't know what it was either. Oh yeah, he ain't dead. Dang it. What are you, what are you? Oh, that's a big moose. That's a big moose. Big moosey. Big. Is that melanistic? Is that melanistic? I think that that might be melanistic. Because that's definitely dark. Sorry for the noise in the background. Sorry guys, I just handled another thing, but this, this moose, I think it's melanistic. It's either melanistic or dark, but it is melanistic. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's a melanistic. Oh my gosh. Holy. Okay. I'm tracking this thing. I'm killing it. Oh my gosh. Sorry for me being loud, but it's a melanistic moose. Oh my gosh, hang on guys, I gotta go mute. Okay, guys, I'm back. I just had to show my sister, but, um, oh my gosh, I just shot at it. I don't know if I hit it, but, oh my gosh, it's a melanistic. 
Oh, my heart's racing. Like, I got a mel- I only have one melanistic, and that's in my, um, and that's a roe deer inside my trophy lodge. And I shot that by accident, but it's just a female, and it's not big. But this is a actually kind of big male moose. A male melanistic. I don't know if I killed it. I don't even think that I hit it. I definitely shot at it. I will track this thing down if it's the last thing that I do. Yeah, but he definitely looked dark. Oh my gosh, my heart is racing. This thing is definitely going into my lodge. But like earlier, when I shot that pronghorn, I thought I was going to mount it because it was... I hit him. I got intestines. Normally intestines would kill it. I don't know about this guy though. But I was just, um, when I got that, I was thinking, I'm trying to get the, um, I'm trying to get a, there's a bison out there. I was thinking, I, I'm trying to get the 7mm, and if I mount this, it, that's not the way to go. And then, I, um, and then I, I got to thinking, I will only mount something if it's a diamond or a rare fur variant. I come to Yukon. And I get a melanistic moose. Well, I don't get it. I haven't got it yet. But it. But I definitely found it. Oh my gosh. There it is. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm so nervous. I don't want to make a mistake. But I will shoot this guy 50 billion times if I have to. Just to kill it. Oh my gosh. I think I, I think I just saw him. No. But he's just over here. He's probably ran by now. But I don't care. Is his tracks going this way? That may not be it. Because its tracks aren't coming up here. I think it definitely ran, so I'm just going to track it. I don't want to lose this moose, because it's melanistic. No, I definitely think that that's it. No, because it's blood it's going this way. Is that it? Is that it? No, that's a bite. I don't care if I have to hit this guy in the flesh 50 billion times. How much bullets do I got? Okay, I got 76 bullets. And my 270. So that should be enough to kill it. Maybe, but I'm gonna dump like 50 rounds into him. I don't care about scoring anymore. I just, right now, all I care about is getting the moose because that's like, I'm like freaking out for no reason. Well, there is a reason. It's melanistic. My favorite, my fa one of my favorite fur types, my favorite, ooh, he's down the 50 to 75, so I don't think that he's going to die. So I think he's gonna, just going to stop bleeding, but... My, so my first favorite is probably Melanistic. My second favorite is Piebald. And then my third favorite is Albino. Because uh, I believe that's the last one. Well, if you guys could feel my heart. It, or like see it, it. It'd be like. It'd be going faster than Usain Bolt. Yeah, that's, that's how fast it's going. Well, that's so cool. And this is a big, this is a big animal for it to be a rare fur variant. I'm so glad I went here. I want to see it and then shoot it. I don't want to see it and then get a super bad shot. I really want to get a lung. Now which way is he going? Because the tracks are going in two directions.
No way. Ooh, it looks like it's dead. It's dead. I just killed the melanistic. Yeah, cause it just went down to zero for some somehow. Oh wait, it must have gone in like a circle. But oh my gosh, it the melanistic is dead. The melanistic is dead. I don't gotta sneak up to it anymore. I can just run. Oh my gosh. Fox, really nobody cares about you right now. Oh, this is this is my fourth rare fur variant. And this is my second nice moose. My first my first nice moose is a diamond. And now this guy is a melanistic. I don't even need to be that track. You should be like right up here. Yeah, but I don't know wh why it went to 50 to 75, all the way down to 0 to 25. Oh my gosh. This is one of my dream animals to kill checked off the list. Because I've always wanted to get a rare fur variant moose. Because I want to hunt moose in real life. And I also want to go to Alaska and hunt moose. I see it. Oh, I see it. Let me get my camera ready. Just like all the other ones that I've gotten besides the other one, but... Huge melanistic. Alright. Yep, he's melanistic. Whoo! We tax that. And we have a party tonight. Dang it, I was going to check to see what it was, but let's go back to the rear trophy lodge. And we'll place this guy down. What is that squeaking sound? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I love melanistics. Yeah, he just popped out of nowhere. I don't think that was even the one that I was tracking. But, this is the place where I get... Where, um, this is the place that I put my diamonds. And my rares. So, so where are we going to put this big moose? Wait, I have a gold wildebeest? No, that's not going to come in here. Actually, I'm going to take everything out of this room. And place them, like, in here. We'll have the diamond and the melanistic up here, so we'll place the diamond right here. And then the melanistic. Oh yeah, I can definitely see the difference. Why? Why did I think that he was going to be the dark color? Yeah, but he's also a big one. So, you can diamond... Their um, antlers look 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 similar, but so two eight seven one nine two. So they, he he would have been like he was bronze. That's because I hit him right in the ham. But, oh my gosh, we got a melanistic. Yes. All right. Now I need to do some lodge rearranging. So I'm thinking we have like the Harlequin, the piebald gold Harlequin, kind of like this, and like where's that one pose that I want, there we go, kind of have them like that, and then we have the Mela and the Albino in that pose, in that one pose that I like.
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, we got a melanistic moose and a brown moose. Alright, bye-bye, YouTube.